All right, yo, listen, we are in a new city. We just touched down in Los Angeles. We were here yesterday. This is the crib. Show them the, show them the crib a bit, show them the crib a bit. It's all right, don't mind it. Good spot, sunny. Now, we're gonna get into it. This is the fucking LA vlog. We're gonna show you guys behind the scenes what's going on. Um, I mean, listen, we're here for one reason and one reason only, because I really wouldn't come to LA if I didn't have to. I'm more of a Miami guy, but I don't wanna talk, talk about that right now. We're here for our Nelk announcement. We officially partnered up with the Nelk Boys, uh, Full Send. Uh, they signed the podcast. We're under the umbrella now. Uh, we're excited to just get it going, to be honest. It's gonna be fucking, it's gonna be big. Later on, we'll show you guys their office, meeting the meeting this, the crew. We met Kyle already, but we haven't met everyone else, so that's gonna be exciting. We'll get some pods in. Uh, anyways, I'm talking too much. Let's get into the fucking vlog, let's go. a year ago to where we are now with the pod it's crazy yeah i don't think i don't think we expected it i'll be straight up i'm like, just I'm saying even like in our careers you know what i mean yeah well, okay. not so much even just the pod from a career perspective it's like because i was always the guy you're the same guy it's just like we're gonna blow up somehow yeah you know what i mean you just keep working and you're like you're gonna fucking blow up yeah, somehow something somehow too. something will come to you where it's like gonna bring you to the next level yeah, well, what I'm saying just, is that no matter, like, even from way back, like, even if you go five, six years. I think we just, like, kept doing things and hoping, not, like, hoping that one of them was going to work. Like, you know what I mean? That's yeah. something would. And, like, it's cool. It's just, like, to see, like, first of all, our business just, like, doing amazing. And then, and then the pot. The pot just fucking, like, obviously taking off the way that it did. It wasn't expected, but at the same time, like... No, not, not that it wasn't expected. It's like you always... No, we expected no, no, it. It was no. just that other people didn't expect it. No, but you do things like in hopes, right? And like, if you're an entrepreneur, I feel like you do multiple things. And you're like, okay, one of these things is going to pop to a certain... Like, you know what I mean? But, what's that next but what I'm saying is what's crazy is that like, all everything we did, there's not one thing that we did that we could take out and still be in this position. You know what I mean? No, no, no. We, we needed everything, everything that we did yeah. to happen. To it's not like we can look back point. and be like, yo, like that one thing, yeah, like we didn't have to do that to get here. Like we had to do everything that we did. I had a fucking clothing brand. This guy had his own two apps, like all these things. And they lead up and we start this marketing agency and we open a restaurant and just whatever. Like it was all these things, but they all had to happen for us to be where we're at now. W's, L's, the whole thing, right? Yo, no one went to believe in the kids, eh? Nobody did. When we did the transition from promoting to neighborhood, not a single soul wanted to believe in the kids. No one. Nobody that fu no nobody that like was let's say paying us to promote or do those things gave us like any business at the beginning. Like it yeah, was they like just didn't think that we were like legitimate legi legi yeah. legitimate at all. Like bro, like we were just promoters. And then the same thing when we started the podcast, people were like, "Yo, like what are you guys talking? Like, like who are you guys to be talking about shit?" Just another uneducated Gino in his mom's basement or parents' basement with a podcast. Jeez, Fuck not, you. Not, no, no, bring it back here, bring it back here. Yeah, dude. Fuck you, bro. We're gonna announce this, and people are gonna be like, oh, like, fuck, they did it. Like, you know what I mean? But we didn't, like, we, if you ask me and you, it's like, yo. No, we haven't. That's crazy. We haven't done, we haven't done shit yet. Like, we haven't done shit yet. But that's yet. why, like, every time there's people out there that they catch a win, and then they just get comfortable with the win. Yeah, mm -hmm. true. You know, it's like, bro, we don't even celebrate shit. Job's not even done, yeah. bro. Like. Like we're about to get signed and it's gonna be like, yeah, that's jokes. Like post a pic, we're signed. And it's like, okay, how, how the fuck are we gonna get to a million subscribers? Like everyone's like, yo, I don't know how you do what you do, but it's like, I just do what I want. Yeah. And what I want is to build brands, be successful. So yeah. if you want that, just go do it. Yeah. But people are always just making excuses but like, bro, and they still make excuses to this day, bro. Me and this guy just always were like, yo, we're gonna be transparent in like everything we do. And that, that will speak for itself and people will appreciate you know the our wins and our L's and how we did things, even if they weren't, um, you know, the, the the normal way of doing it, the the conventional way of doing things. We always did things, I think, pretty unconventional, but we, you know, the the, the outcome always came out to what we wanted was that is to stand out. People out there that don't have big dreams and shit, which is fine. But like, if what you're trying, if you're trying to have big dreams and you have big dreams, then yo, you gotta stand out. If people forget about you, you're not standing out, bro. We're in. 
just uh, cookies and cakes. Uh, just shoe shopping. Just trying to see what the fuck we're gonna fuck buy. We're keeping it crispy today, boys. Do you understand? This is the time everyone's been waiting for. Sorla is finally gonna transition. Today's a big day. We're on our way to the Full Send office. We're going to announce our partnership with them. Um, Full Send presents the MBH podcast. We're on our way there. Ernesto hopefully doesn't kill us on the way there because his driving has been horrendous this whole time. That's not true. <laughs> but, uh, but nonetheless, we will check you guys when we're there. Let's get to it. Right now. This place is sick. Like it? Yeah. Wow. Yeah, you guys are real, bro. No, 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 no. no. Yeah, it's kind of crazy. You walk in, there's yeah. fucking 20 cameras. We're like, all right. We gotta bring the MBH setup, you know? Gotta get real, real deep with these combos. We gotta be face to face, two v one. Heavy hitter, man. John is a real G, dude. This guy is like, his background is insane. The guy dropped gems on gems on gems, and then we win like almost like an hour forty. That was like so cool, Logan. That was but crazy. Like, but I think like I think we could have easily gone two hours plus. Two and a half hours, like, yeah. comfortably. And, and you, know, you know the beauty was like he just talked. We didn't have to say much, which I which I always love because that just means that they're just getting their thoughts out, you know? I told you. Stop it, I'm Jay. Listen. See you guys killing it. Money by trying, bro. Trying, 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 bro. Hell yeah. You guys are coming on the full sun, right? Yeah. Let's go. Yeah. You guys are from Canada? Yeah, Toronto. Wow. Yeah. yeah. You've been you've been in Toronto for sure. Yeah, yeah. I've been here once. Huh? You like it? Yeah, it's no, Sorry. Very nice people. Yeah, yeah. People are very nice. So nice. Too nice sometimes, bro. <laughs> Headed to the gym in the in the Full Sun headquarters. It's gonna be sick. We just got our uh, the key key to the castle, boys. The operation here is insane. You don't even you don't even know how much goes into it until you're just here. Like this is outdoor. This is crazy. This is like look at check the barbed wire. Fucking Alcatraz in here. Can't get in. Can't get out. Yo, this is crazy. crazy. Red tour? It's a little bright sometimes, but yeah, it's dope. Yo, this is unreal. It's everything. Yeah, we got like every essential. We got space for extra. You guys stuff use too. it a lot though? People use I, I don't work at it really. <laughs> but uh, some people some people used it like a lot and then people kinda went home and went away. So some people yeah. stopped using it. Yeah, but yeah. Uh, I mean, you guys we'll get got back everything. It. It's dope if you work shirt, work out shirtless, just get it dirty. Perfect, you guys got yeah, 150s. Yeah. Now I know, no, I can do it now. I'm increasing the fucking J's. Now I gotta bring it back. Yeah, bring it back. Man. Well okay, in, lad. Sleep now. <laughs> where's the sleep pills? <laughs> well in, lad. Supplements.co, MBH, 15, 15% off of your life insurance. <laughs> we're out, we're out of here, we're out of here. Let's go. All right, listen. We came here, we conquered LA, not really, I fucking hate this place. And to be completely honest with you, we're actually, we paid to leave early, because this place is fucking garbage anyways. But we came here, we got the job done. We're officially presented by Full Set, part of the team now, part of the family, we're excited about it. Um, and we're gonna get firing. We're heading back home to Toronto for a little bit before we head off to Miami. Um, yeah, it's been a fucking slice. And LA, I won't come back unless I have to. I hope I don't have to. <laughs>